Welcome to Intercontinental Specialty Fans Sundarabha Hut or commonly known as ISF. We are the largest producer of premium grade specialty fats and oils catering to the global food industries. For your information, ISF is part of Nishin Olio Group Japan. We are fully committed towards maintaining the highest safety and health standards. To all employees and vendors, welcome to ISF. We would like to seek your attention to spend a few minutes watching the following safety video which will guide you how to behave while in a working environment that could be hazardous. ISF is an organization or premise owner that puts occupational safety and health as one of our core pillar, whether to our employees or external parties that are in our premises for various purposes. Management commitment is clearly outlined by the Occupational Safety and Health Policy. Establishment of Occupational Safety and Health Manual, Safety Guidelines and Safe Operating Procedures that have been developed according to our mode. Ultimately, our key priority is to ensure that everyone leaves our premises safely. This video will also cover necessary safe work practices, emergency procedures and safety violations. We hope your time in ISF is an enjoyable one, but more importantly, a safe journey. Always remember, keselamatan dan kesihatan adalah budaya ISF. All arrival at our factories in Dunkil and Port Klang. Please park at the designated parking areas only. Please proceed to register yourself at the security station. Our security personnel will check if you have an appointment and inform the person you need to visit. You are required to produce your identification card and relevant documents to our security officers for VMS registration purposes. You will also be required to fill up necessary forms or documents such as health and tools declaration. Once completed, you will be issued a visitor slip along with a visitor pass. Please ensure that you wear this pass wherever you are. It is a requirement for all contractors and visitors to wear personal protection equipment or PPE which meets our minimum site standards. For contractors, it is your company's responsibility to supply PPE to you. Contractors will be required to fill up the safety induction form and the relevant information required. Once completed, they will be briefed on safety matters. The safety officer will also inspect their PPEs. A safety induction sticker will be placed on their hard hat to indicate that they have attended the safety induction. Please follow the instruction of your host and walk on the designated pedestrian walkways to your destinations. Any vehicles entering and exiting our premises will be subjected to security check. Please give your cooperation to our security officers and follow the instructions given. All tankers entering and exiting our premises will be subjected to 100% seal check. inspection area is installed with a personal fall arrest system which is one of platform specially designed for the ease of inspection before stepping on top of the tanker to check manhole seal the safety harness must be lashed to the personal safety arrest system before lowering the steps onto the tanker
Once the inspectors have given the clearance, the drivers can proceed to the respective destinations. A permit to work system is a document which sets out the work to be done and precautions to be taken for all possible hazards involved. Examples of jobs needing work permits are as follows. Hot works, enter and work in confined spaces, work at height, carrying large or complex equipment, high accident risk works. It is compulsory to apply work permit at the safety department prior to any works carried out. The department contracting the job should prepare a written clearance detailing the jobs to be done and get it authorized by the safety officer before allowing the contractors to commence work in the respective areas. ISF promotes an open reporting culture. In any cases of an accident or a medical emergency, the head of department, supervisor or security personnel will have to be notified immediately. The person reporting the incident will have to fill the incident accident report form and submit to the relevant authorized personnel. To ensure the safety of our factories, our state-of-the-art facilities are equipped with the fire protection system. Our fire protection systems are linked to the main fire protection panel located at the main security station and fully monitored 24 hours a day. In case of an emergency of fire, please remain calm when you hear the fire alarm. Stop work immediately. Wait until you hear the order for evacuation. Head to the nearest emergency exit and evacuate the premise immediately. To open the door in case of the loss of power, you should break the emergency safety glass. Follow the directions given by the floor wardens. Leave your personal belongings behind and proceed to the nearest exit point as directed. Do not use the elevators. When walking down the stairs, walk in an orderly manner. Do not run or push. Please follow the instruction of the floor wardens to the assembly point area. At the assembly point, a roll count or head count will be taken. Please refer to the following assembly point areas for the respective premises. You can only return to the premise once it has been instructed to do so by the fire department. At ISF plants, we conduct regular fire drills by supervised local fire station officers to ensure that our staff and visitors are fully prepared in case of emergencies. Our safety committee also works closely to ensure our safety drills are up to the approved standard. Our premises is strictly no smoking and no vaping. Smoking and vaping is only allowed at designated smoking areas. Items such as alcoholic beverages, illegal drugs, firearms, and weapons are strictly prohibited on all our premises. Photography and video recording is strictly prohibited. Persons under the influence of alcohol or illegal drugs are not permitted to enter our premises. Anyone found to be a violation of our rules and regulations will be dealt accordingly. This video serves as a guide to ensure that you have a safe, pleasant journey when you visit our premise. If you have any questions regarding this safety video, 
Please do contact our safety committee and we will be glad to assist you further.